Hello everyone, my name is Alex and um, I recently had spinal cord injury on my uh, thoracic spine and the T8 section which resulted uh, um, blood clot and um, surgery and uh, I have been in recovery since then. It's uh, been 15 days. Um, I recently got out of the hospital and uh, been admitted to a acute rehab for a uh, three week long rehab program to um, regain some independence and uh, um, life function and life, life functions um, before transitioning transitioning to a um, a a different lifestyle I paralyzed the lifestyle so this is my first day first official day in my rehab um, hospital and uh, it's a place called the Glen Cove um, rehab center in uh, Long Island uh, by New York area and um, Sorry, I thought someone was coming in, and uh, the, it has been an exhausting day. Um, this this uh, place is really nice, um, a little bit older facility and everything, but uh, um, the program, the equipment, the technology, and then the uh, knowledge are um, very um, fantastic. Also, the food is really amazing. They have a a, uh, a different menu each day, and uh, I was reading through the menus, <laughs> and then I'll be like, "Whoa, I'm looking forward to this. I'm looking forward to that. I'm looking forward to every day," <laughs> which is really important because as my appetite comes back, um, since the surgery, um, having some like you know, um, delicious food to look forward to, I think is very important. And uh, I'm really excited just to, you know, um, going through the days and ex and then looking forward to <laughs> eating really delicious uh, stuff. So I'm very, very happy, very excited. Um, so the first day I uh, met with, uh, you know, the doctors, um, a physical therapist and the occupational therapists and uh, the nurses and everyone else. And uh, people are really nice, very professional. Um, and, uh, they're very like, you know, like boom, 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 go, go, go. And they're very on the point. Um, although I didn't get to do much um, therapy today, today is mostly, you know, a, a, lot, a lot about like interviewing about like my situation, my goals and my current conditions and examinations and, and questions and stuff like that. Um, but I did do, I did get to do one, um, hour of, uh, physiotherapy. Um, this one hour was pretty intense. Uh, I did it from 2.30 to 3.30 and, uh, I was really exhausted. I was like, um, perspiring. I was like body, my body was like working and, uh, it was, you know, like not easy for me. And uh, it was challenging, and I, I love the challenge, and I keep pushing myself and uh, <laughs> keep needing to take breaks because I can't go too far. <laughs> and uh, um, the people are really uh, fantastic to work with, and they're really fun, and then they have a whole bunch of like crazy uh, equipments. Um, so because my injury is uh, um, at the middle back area, so... Um, from may probably like just the, you know uh l middle back down is all paralyzed for now um i mean the the full um damage is still unknown but um right now it's just you know uh the current situation is the way it is uh the doctor told me that there will be permanent damages um expected but they don't know what they don't know where they don't know um like how exactly but there will be some. Um, to that, I am 
just shrugging my shoulders because you know um i will focus on my recovery first the uh, spinal cord as uh, saguru mentioned before has a uh, regenerative power on its own and i'm not too worried about that i just want to know the you know the recovery how far the recovery is going to take me and then how much further you know um additional work that i need to do but that's a totally different story why am i going there i don't even know um so oh yes um so they have crazy equipment here um because i have i'm paralyzed from the uh the 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 i'm paralyzed from the chest down basically um it's really hard for me to you know stand up to walk anytime soon but they would have machines and uh, stuff like that to help uh, people like me to stand up, to walk, to train the body and the muscles and the entire system to continue to remember how this normal function is supposed to be um, instead of just, you know, like completely giving it all up. They also told me that... Uh, um, when my legs is on bed um i cannot lift i cannot do anything and it feels like you know this is it but if gravity is uh, being eliminated i actually have some muscle movements on both legs the left one is much better than the right but like they both have some sort of movements it's just you know um with the heaviness of the legs um you can't tell um i'm not strong enough to actually do much to do anything observable but some muscle muscular um strength or like signal is still intact i mean <laughs> when i heard that news i almost burst into tears <laughs> um so i was extremely happy about that i just need to you know um uh, make sure um, that during my recovery, I do not do any further damages to the legs and the feet and the ankles and all the joints. Because um, when the muscles are not moving, um, the blood circulation is really bad. So blood clots are, you know, a normal concern. Um, also, when the muscles are not moving, the feet are sort of like could swing you know different ways and then they could like um contort and then like just go into like weird shapes and then it's harder to get them back so a bunch of things that need to be taken care of a lot of uh you know um wearing you know those like big ass boots for sleeping and 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 uh kind of like um air pumps uh, at night time just to keep the blood circulation and also preventing clots and stuff like that so um those are the things that i need to do i'll come back i'll come back don't worry um besides that um i there's also this big um uh, crazy machine that i will be put on to to actually like stand and walk um and and and, and it was just like crazy crazy stuff it's my second day and i'll be put onto this like really fancy machine which only exists um which only which there's only five pieces of this machine in the uh us so they have it here so i'm like really excited to to go on and to try it and uh so i'm like <laughs> totally psyched um so it's very exciting for me um it's a big change since the last two weeks um it's change of scenery change of location change of people change of like entire um totally different chapter um this is, will be a pretty intense um three weeks Comparing to the, it's a different intensity. <laughs> the last two weeks were intense because, you know, the recovery, the headaches, and then all the, you know, emotional and then, you know, traumatic kind of like side of things. And uh, the, 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 the injury and surgery side of things. And this 
future three weeks are going to be very physical, very like dedication and very determination and just pushing myself to the limit as much as I could, kind of like intense. So I'm really, really, really happy to be here. This is like a boot camp for disabled and paralyzed people. <laughs> this is like the best way I could describe it. But um, I hope that there are more <clears throat> places, more programs um, like this that are open to, you know, um, people like me to be to participate. Um, you know, like I, I know this is like acute, like which is supposed to be short term and temporary. But like, I, I, I don't know, I feel like people um, like me sometimes may need more like intense uh, on a, you know, um, periodically basis, like maybe every year or every, you know, six months or something like that, just to, you know, continue with their um, progress and support and going to like physio, you know, um, at the rate, whichever, you know, the insurance allows, it's just the bare minimum and uh, to actually be able to recover to you know get better requires much more intense um activities also of course you could do them you know a lot of them you could do at home with your family members and friends and uh it's also you know that's also fantastic too um so i guess um i guess there are different ways yeah different ways but um, I, I'm definitely really happy to be here. I'm definitely um, excited about this uh, coming three weeks and uh, really up for the challenge. And i <laughs> so happy. Um, all the problems that I had, not all, all the, you know, headaches and the pains and, and um, that I had before has sort of like subsided. Um, this, this, this time has been a um a totally different um experience so i'm really looking forward to it and uh i i i hope i can maximize maximize my um my effort in here and uh um hopefully um get the most out of this program so that's my first day uh of uh of uh, the new rehab I'm sure by tomorrow <laughs> I will have more to say about like those three hours of physiotherapy. <laughs> All right, this is it for today. Have a good night.